Salam Ibu Pertiwiku. You are now watching English News at 5. Keep watching. Three applications in session in relation to the case of Sarawak government suing Petronas over its unpaid 5% state sales tax, SST. According to Assistant Minister in the Chief Minister's Department for Law, State, Federal Relations and Project Monitoring, Datuk Sharifah Hasidah Said Aman Ghazali, the three to four applications with one application to the judge. The second on the jurisdiction of the court as they want to transfer to the federal court and some other objections. She added that it would be normal for Petronas to object and she expected Petronas to throw in all sorts of objections and applications but as the law is concerned, Sarawak can win this case. On another note, Judicial Commissioner Christopher Chin has fixed January 23rd to decide whether he should recuse himself from presiding over the High Court case of Sarawak versus Petronas for unpaid SST. He has to make a decision over the matter following the application made by Petronas. However, State Legal Counsel Datuk Sri J.C. Fong said that Petronas' main ground for asking Chin to recuse himself is because he is just a temporary judge and might not be made a full judge if he continues to preside over the case. The unpaid SST for 2019 to the tune of 1.3 billion ringgit by Petronas, the state government is relying on the Malaysian Agreement 1963, Oil Mining Ordinance 1958 and State Sales Tax 1998, SST 98, as the basis of its case, but Petronas is arguing that the SST 98 is ultra vias, null and void. No compound notice yet received by Parti Rakyat Sarawak PRS from the Malaysian Anti-Corruption Commission MACC, in regards to the party receiving funds from 1MDB. PRS President Tan Sri Dr. Amar Dr. James Jumut Masing responded to the reporters when asked to comment on MACC Chief Commissioner Latifa Koya's recent statement that the Anti-Corruption Authority will take action against those who have not paid up despite compound notices issued to them for receiving funds from 1MDB, and PRS is among the political parties named in the list. No, they, they haven't asked me yet to pay back, so why, why should I pay? No, they, they, there was a report a, yeah, few, years ago, there was a few days ago that she said she should take to court anybody who does not pay. No, they haven't sent us anything yet, so I'll just wait and see. Huh? Asked if the party had struck a deal with MACC on paying the funds by installment, Masing said the party did not do so. Uh, no, 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 no deal. We just tell them what we're doing. That's it. So far, there's nothing. I keep my fingers crossed. Now. There's nothing so far. Okay. Okay, all right. He said this after officiating the Public Works Department JKR Sarawak Safety and Quality Forum welcoming dinner last night. Well, that is all for now. Keep updated to news at TV Sarawak anytime, anywhere.